Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and this is about the C updates that we had last week. The C updates are of course the uh, updates for bug fixes in general. So they're optional and you don't have to imply them if you don't want to. Now the C updates of last week have done a little bit of problems for uh, especially some apps. It seems that since the C update, if you have broken apps or apps that don't work well, um, what happens is that apparently apps that use the .NET framework might have issues since that update. So uh, what you could do, and if you do have app issues with the last update, if you applied it, simply go into your uh, settings app, go into Windows Update, and in Windows Update, go into Update History. So the update that was installed last week, of course, is KB5012643. This is the one causing any problems right now. So what you want to do is simply go down the list, and there's Uninstall Updates. It's going to bring you to the page where you can click that update and click the Uninstall button. And this will temporarily fix your issues. You'll have to restart your machine. Now, this update, of course, is going to reinstall itself with Patch Tuesday. Uh, hopefully, um, Microsoft has a week to fix this. So hopefully, in that week with Patch Tuesday, they will have fixed whatever issue there was with this uh, problem. So uh, if you have app update issues, uh, or app issues, sorry, and it's Windows 11 only, by the way. If you're on Windows 10, there's no such problem. It's really just Windows 11 that seems to be affected by this flaw where apps can be broken. Uh, and only apps that use a .NET framework uh, in a certain way, actually. So it's not every app also that is broken. It's really specific apps that will react in certain ways. So if you had issues, just remove the update. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.